viewers and subscribers <clears throat> peace love and unity you know it's your guys Ricardo from one love africa so walk we are walking on chalit me and one of my bridging yeah right here in kenya so we are going to the shop right now check out some stuff today what today a muslim holiday right yeah yeah eid <clears throat> happy eid yeah man so me and a muslim in the boat have to give support and respect to people religion you know because that's all we about jamaicans showing love and support right across the board so anyways let's try to chat glass shop walk through the neighborhood see what's going on see there it's a cool evening we have a banana tree there people shopping getting their stuff walk where I walk come move fast enough. Cause we don't want the rain catch me in a star chad we are chad it you know we need that like a local community if you can call it so yeah man so first of all I want to say give thanks for those who subscribe give thanks for those who show me love give thanks to those for those <coughs> who acknowledge my page who actually share it and make it work yeah man because without you guys the page wouldn't reach so far and we love to see yo what go on what I mean we love to see the Jamaican people them show me love and support me yard them so this is a friend of mine Oh, I'll go on. The man here, Fred. I'll oh, go on, Fred. Only for, I'm, I'm good. You good? Only for Manchester City fan. Over well, yeah, here. Manchester City Manchester fan. Manchester City over here. Oh, Manchester, Manchester now go on good from what you want. I'm going to lose. Yeah, but we not we not lose. We drew. Alright, we not lose a draw. When they come at Teddy Hard. Yeah. Go and beat them bad. Go yeah. Beat them bad. <laughs> beat them bad. <laughs> beat them bad. Surely. Yeah, so Fred. Surely. So Fred, tell him the, com what com name of, the name of this community. The name of the community is Ruaka. Ruaka and Kiambu. Trotta. In, in Kiambu County. Yeah. Kiambu County, Ruaka. Yeah, man. So, we they are chill. Fred is a man. I, if in any community or the neighborhood, and you want a car to wash or you want a carpet to wash, Fred is the guy who do Over that. Yes, ma, ma, yeah, Mount man. Zion Car Wash. Mount auto, Zion Car auto Wash. wash. Wait, Mount name? Zion Auto Car Wash. Mount Zion Auto Car Wash. Fred yeah, do that. Do you that. understand? True so, that. you understand? Say something for the Jamaican people. Eh? Wait, wait, what would you like to talk to Yo, the Jamaican people right now? Them should free all bus. Free oh, all bus. <laughs> free all bus. Free world bus. Free all bus. <laughs> right? Yeah, man. Gaza. Gaza forever. Gaza never. forever. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, first to the free world bus. Gaza first to stay. So anything first to my friend Adidas. I will land shatter. Right, I will land shatter. Cool. So first to free Gaza. Free world bus. Only thing is the vibes got to the free hour. I mean, I like feeling free you now because the music nowadays, the music is good. Our music, I climb, see them way. Now I bash the youths them. You understand? Good music still a job. But when Vibes Cartel come out, people are like to hear where I come up with if you can keep up with the time. And you know, so I teach you that. You must feature that. <laughs> but the man thing, man, you know the thing already. They start chat through the place. Where they? Oh, yes, yeah, they? Ask club, you have to pass all the place there. Yes, I. So back to me and say, big up the people who are showing love and support and like, and who are subscribed to the video. All the people from different different countries like South Africa, Belgium, Italy, France, Germany, um, Saint Vincent, Bermuda, Barbados. Um, what is more country we see them? Angola, we see Egypt. Uh, people from Ethiopia and people from Rwanda, Uganda, Botswana, Tanzania, people from Trinidad and Tobago, big up the yard of them, England, Germany, as I said, big up all of the people who show love and support. But there, so I look for a nice piece of land right now. Yeah, this some farming. See it there? Nice piece of land. If you don't want to buy, you can check it out. I don't know the price fit it, and right now this video is not about that. So I'm gonna check out my guy right now because I'm a Nigerian bridging a walk through the place. 
get some stuff on the roadside. Where are you dog? Yeah, man. Fresh natural fruits and vegetables and food. Anything you guys want, just come right here so and buy. If you're around, if you're not around, you can still get it anywhere else. Where are you? Yeah, man. Where are I said I want to eat now, you're talking about Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. Someone want to eat now, you say Saturday. Where are the tomato? I do not eat this Saturday. Where are the tomato? Uh, no, no, I am um, sweet, sweet potato. An egg? Yeah. Your neighbor does she have? Hmm? Nobody has here. Ah. Where are the sweet potato? Yes. Sweet potato? On the side there. Alright, on the front. You can go up on the front and get see put it out there. We go there. If you want. Yo, yo, yo. So we have some sweet potato. We can't get the sweet potato. Sweet potato. So we have to walk up on the front and say we can get some sweet potato right there. So. Yeah, yeah, walk. Let's go. Try it, yeah, try it. Get some sweet potato. You are in a pot. Well, not even me, because I already cooked my pot already. You know. <clears throat> already cooked. Child, we are challenging in Kenya, you know, Nairobi, Kenya. One love Africa, we're there. And we don't make people fear, we don't make people scared of we, you know. And we don't scare the people either. We show love and support. And the people in Nefe tune in, see if they can come to Africa, see if they want to learn more about the culture, they want to unite, they want to visit. You don't have to be here, it can also be like a neighboring country. So Ethiopia is nice, and Rwanda is nice, but they come on to like living, getting the documents like a residency. Rwanda is just a family country. So if you go to Rwanda with like uh, five kids, three kids, you want them to enroll into the school program, it's easy. Easy to get them register, easy to get them in school, easy to get a work permit, easy to get residency, easy to start business. Rwanda. Yes, I walk, we are walk, we are walk. Right now, man, I walk and I try, we are trying it. This side, Kenya. How far are we go? Right down this, right? Yeah. So let me know. I was here today trimming, taking a shave. Local barber shop. You understand? That's where I take my shave and I trim sometimes. Fresh cut. So I just get a fresh cut today. Right over there. Today we have flex like a local for as well. Band with the people, have our vibes in the street. Wow. Yes, I. Jamaicans were safe in Kenya. Do not let no one trick you and tell you otherwise. We're good. See the street food. Street food. Everything was said a slogan. Sure. Uh, pork, pig, pork center. For those who want to eat the arnold, you can come get some pork. So, right now, we have to go down this stuff. Yo, 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 yo. Yeah, next thing more to talk about. I saw a video on YouTube where this Jamaican man um, he's living in Jamaica and you have a girl in Africa. And he said that he's been sending money to, the, to this lady and supporting her, supporting her four kids and Jano Star. Just by listening to the man's story, <coughs> I feel good because you know, I see man nowadays, these men nowadays, don't do, they don't do those shit. They're not going to be in a 
Caribbean country, African country, and send them money for women they never meet before. They only meet online and talking to. And you have to respect the man for that. Respect the Jamaicans or any Caribbean country or any real man out there who do things like this because the girl has four kids and the guy actually taking money. If you see the guy do for a living, I mean, me know Jamaica tough, it's rough in the streets, you understand? It's really rough in the streets. And the guy taking money, Marcel, peanut, bag juice, suck suck, tambourine, you know, sweet candies, some stuff on the road. In a bucket, a five gallon water bucket, you walk the street, hot sun, I'm taking money and sent to a lady in Africa with four kids, sending the kids to school because that's a theme empress. Him and her start a relationship and it's going good. He's trying to get her to come to Africa, but for some reason, every time when she is supposed to come, it's always a problem at the airport. So, to come to Jamaica, you don't need a visa as an African, <coughs> straight up. You understand? To come to Jamaica as an African, you, don't not, you do not need a visa. So, he's trying to get her to come and I don't know, I think the agent, the travel agent who booked his ticket, messed, who booked the lady ticket, messed up. So, this point, the, the point of this video is to show support, love and respect for that brother because that no man there, gold heart, they are take every dime we have and I send, the yard, I send from yard to take care of this lady and her kids. I'm going to respect the man for that. Real man, the real things. You understand? Real guy, the real things. So big up. Big up the man for that. I do not know his name, but he's in Ocherius. And for those who do not know, Ocherius is my town. You understand? Ocherius is my town. So big up the man for that. Love and respect. And shout out for the YouTubers who captured that video. You understand? Hello, good evening. Yeah man, so right now we are Roca Villa. Our valley Roca Valley. It's kinda late. What time about seven? Almost seven o'clock. Seven PM. So I'm showing you guys what's going on. Nice place, cozy, quiet, comfortable. Security cameras are there to show you guys in case anyone feel unsafe. Don't worry, you're safe. As you can see, we have some nice chairs. Mm. Proper, 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 proper. You understand? Nice place, very cozy. Nice curtains. Decor is good. And if you want to get your own apartment and do something like this, it's not expensive. You understand? See there? 500,000. Can get you something for yourself. So see there? 500,000. <laughs> Watch what's going on, watch what's going on. This is the balcony, balcony one. Right here. Balcony two, Netflix. This is a Netflix. So you have a Netflix, you have your internet, everything, what you might want for your comfort, hot water. This is the kitchen area. Four burners, ovens, four burners, oven, oven. Come on, gas stove, microwave. Everything you might need, your pots and everything is here. Your cupboard to so pack your stuff away. Show you guys. Some, see? So if you want, and I can turn to go higher. As you can see the settings, the fridge. Refrigerator. See there. Yeah. Balcony two. This way you do your laundry. It's the back balcony. You can put a washing machine right here or we'll do the laundry right here. But if you come to book this apartment for Airbnb, long term, short term stay, you don't need to buy the washing machine. You don't need to buy the washing machine. You don't have to worry about that. We will take care of this for you. So if you're coming with your laundries and stuff, you're staying here for long term, like over a week or so, and you want to do washing, we got it for you. We got someone to wash someone to hang someone to rings someone to press your clothes if you don't want to press if you want a personal chef just know that i'm here if you want someone to pick you from the airport we're here if you want someone to take you around to show you in the town 
the tour guide work we are here you understand one love africa team with jump tour africa we just recently team up together and we're making good moves right now in africa we're showing people around we're picking up people from the airport we're dropping off people on time you're not taking a long way you're taking the express route we pay for that out of our pocket we make sure you get a good service that you can't complain about you know we are jamaicans now so yeah they have to hustle <laughs> which jamaicans you know do that hustle hustle is a must right yeah man so let me show you guys the rest of the place so this is the wash on the area where you wash your hands i made that you know peace <laughs> this is the bathroom area as you can see hot water is there as you can see it's just like that and it's only 35 usd right now right now 35 usd per day see it's not bad one bedroom nice little closet area a mirror is there to see yourself closet hang on show you guys around you know what i mean you see what's going on so tell me does it worth it or not i'm telling you just 35 usd per day so as you guys see for yourself yeah jamaica in kenya airbnb ready so if you want to book airbnb i want to book this apartment reach out to me this is our apartment and this is what we're putting up for airbnb long term short term 35 usd per night for short term but if you want to book it long term i give you a discount rate from over three weeks to three months you get a discount between three weeks to three months you get a discount and anything over three months like six months one year it could be even four months five months you get a cheaper rate so the more longer you go is more short to recharge you because we do not want to overcharge people we just want to make sure that you're safe you're secure all the bills are paid you don't have to, don't have to worry about water electricity internet you don't have to worry about gas you don't have to worry about nothing maybe maybe all the food cleaning is going to be on you though as long as you give it those discount the cleaning is going to be on you so as a jamaican brother right now here in africa i can't give the support and as my jamaican brother called kenya kenyans jamaicans we are one we are all african people we are one it doesn't matter if you're born in africa you're born out of africa you visit africa you never meet and um, been in africa we are just one cross the board no segregation no separation one love one unity one power one people one heart one blood one that is why i said one love africa so if anyone any of you like what i'm doing like this channel please give us support share to people if you want to come to africa it does if you don't want to come to kenya you want to go to tanzania or rwanda south africa anywhere in africa because i have people there I have been to some places and some places I haven't reached as yet. The reason why, because I'm too caught up in some stuff I'm doing right here. But trust me, Johannesburg, South Africa, Cape Town, I'm coming there. So look out for me because there's an Africa tour that me and the crew are going on. And don't forget, but don't forget about the trip that we are planning to go to Jamaica. So it's going to be a 10 day trip. As I said, it's in the making. We're trying to finalize it because some people have to work some people can't go for 10 days i would do not want to be a case that you have to leave and you have to book a plane to come back by yourself because work are emergency so we're trying to finalize a date that many people can be free for 10 days or maybe we cut the trip shorter it could be seven days trip just one week seven days from kenya to jamaica and for those who's reaching out to me about if there's a direct flight no there's no direct flight between nairobi or anywhere in kenya to jamaica there's no direct flight as yet maybe they're working on it but there's no direct flight so right now we're going to make a transit flight so you're going to be passing through other places and that's going to make the trip more excited because we're going to go to other places we're going to stay here see other places like other countries and then straight into jamaica 
you guys go to the hotels or the apartment the estate and you guys can relax drop off your luggage and stuff get some good food to eat and the way going there and when you stop off you guys that the place is like the food places get some jerk chicken who want to eat pork and eat jerk pork <laughs> who want to get some jamaica beer jamaica rum on the trip going down something snick snack whatever it is you can get some souvenir stuff on your way going to the apartment when you finish you can drop off your luggage and then from there yeah man because i ask questions where in jamaica is the best place i can bring my people remember i'm a jamaican i know a lot of places but for those who is watching my video i want to make you guys be a part of this i want you guys to give me the best places that you think i can bring my kenyan supporters i can bring you because one i'm going to bring them to dunzura falls and someone said blue hole blue hole sentence yeah man me have to bring a blue hole all who can't swim Stay up and land. <laughs> so they all bring them got blue wall. Bring them got um, Portland for sure. I don't know what's about Portland enough. You know. Portland away the boat land. Paul Bogle Parish. So we have to bring them to Blue Hole. We have to bring them to Portland. We have to bring them got Dunzero Falls. So any more places like Bob Marley Museum, yes, it's a must. You can't bring them to Kenya. I mean, never bring them to Bob Marley Museum. It's a must. They didn't go there and the beaches they have to see the beaches in jamaica what it's like to see the difference between beaches in the caribbean and beaches um in africa and that is just the first trip the second trip we're planning to go to our next caribbean island so if you guys watching the video please like subscribe share drop your comments drop the comments so we can ask where do you think i should bring this trip uh, this trip is going to be an epic trip. I, I want them to be to places to see what it's like in the Caribbean, not just Jamaica. Jamaica is just one. I want Jamaica a little bit with Talawa. You understand? We, Jamaicans are everywhere. So we have a big up yard. So I have to make them see what it's like in the yard. And then I have to bring them to a nearby country like Trinidad, for sure. Um, Barbados. Yeah, man. Bahamas and Barbados. We can bring them to these places and anywhere else in the Caribbean. Um, like Cayman Island and all this BVI Island. If you guys think uh, it's the right idea to bring them, bring my people here for this trip, in the links in the description, go in the comment section, comment, comment, comment. Let me know the second trip and it's going to be a third trip. But we are moving small steps. So let's go to Jamaica first. You guys can see the reaction video, and then from that we can know what to do. So yeah, man, I made this. One Love Africa. My name is Ricardo. Follow my Instagram page, One Love Africa. My music page on YouTube. Um, no, on TikTok. S L U G A N Music. That is slogan music. And I also have a catering page called Ricardo Kitchen. So check it out on TikTok. Ricardo Kitchen slogan music. Instagram, One Love Africa. You understand? And you can also follow me on other places. Just type in one look Africa and everything will come up. I'm here. Don't bite your neck. Don't bite your lips. Don't bite your teeth. You see me, I say, well, go on. <laughs>